Truly it is through the Lord's hand that you're coming together and stepping out from this day as Mr. and Mrs. Chris and Marley Spencer. Love God and love each other. To my soon-to-be husband, I thank God that he put you in my life and that we've been able to make so many memories together that have led up to this day. I knew you were special before I even met you. You're truly the man of my dreams. You make me feel so loved, cared for, and understood. Thank you for choosing me and for always fighting and defending our love. You're the hardest worker I know. You inspire me to work harder, dream bigger, and trust God. Thank you for loving my family. It makes me so happy that you fit in so seamlessly. I can't wait to grow old with you and make many more memories together. I love you. Can't wait to see how handsome you'll look today. Love, your bride to be. Marley, God is good. We are here. You're probably going to tell me the same thing. But as you get ready, let all the worries and stresses disappear. Enjoy every minute of it, just as I have enjoyed every minute of knowing you. With you, all my worries float away. My life feels right and my heart feels full. I cannot wait to finally see you in that white dress, saying yes and I do. I can't imagine spending my life with anybody else. And I can't wait to let the adventures unfold. I love you. On behalf of Chris and Marley and their parents, thank you so much for coming today and sitting out in the drizzle. It may not be the most beautiful day, but this is one of the most beautiful couples I've had the privilege of marrying. Today, Lord, we celebrate with you. We celebrate with them. We give you the glory, the honor, and the praise. Every good and perfect gift comes from you, and we can't think of a greater gift than, than that of love. And today, as a Chris and Marley express and profess their love for each other before us, we thank you for the homes that they've been raised in, and for the example of their parents and their love for each other and for you. True love, God love goes first. Tell each other every day. Go public with your love. Continue to write songs for her and sing them to her. Cook for him. Go on dates, hold hands, and so on the days where it is really hard, trust in him, look to him, lean on him. True love goes the distance. It goes first, and it's public. I charge you both, Chris and Marley, as you stand in the presence of God and before these witnesses, to remember that love and loyalty to each other are essential in building a happy home. If you faithfully keep the vows that you are about to make and seek to honor God at all times in your marriage, your life will be filled with joy and your home will abide in peace. No other human ties are more tender and no other vows are more sacred than these that you are about to make. I, Chris, take you, Molly Clark. I, Marley, take you, Chris Spencer. To be my wife. To be my husband. To have and to hold. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. As long as we both shall live. This, this is, is my, my promise to you. With this ring. And with my heart's full affection. I declare, I declare my love for you. Whereas you both now pledged your love and commitment to each other in the presence of God and these witnesses, I do as a minister of the gospel pronounce you husband and wife. Whom God has joined together, let no one separate. Chris, you may kiss your bride.
and groom, Mr. and Mrs. Spencer. I, along with two of my siblings, were there when Marley and Chris first met. We invited Marley, who was back for Thanksgiving from Carleton University, to come out and have a coffee with us. From the moment Marley arrived to the moment we all got up and left, Chris did not say a word. <laughs> and yet, here we are at their wedding. I love you both from the bottom of my heart and appreciate you letting me be the third wheel to this relationship. Chris, I'm going to miss you as a roommate. Um, listening to each other as we walk in the door. Um, getting to hear how God is, sorry, stirring in you. But I know that the only person who could do a better job of being your roommate is Marley. Marley, today I stand proud to attest. I stand proud to attest to the woman of God you are becoming. I see the effort you make, Chris, to make godly decisions in your relationship. Marley, I hear the patience and choice of words when you're responding. These choices matter in a marriage. I see you making an effort to put Chris first. Choose to love each other every day and the rest won't matter. Love is a choice and I'm so glad you chose each other. So the only real way to, uh, to begin is to comment on how stunningly beautiful Marley you look today. And uh, the beauty on the outside is just a fraction of the beauty on the inside. And then for Chris, your presence and your radiance light up the room, which is a true testimony to the presence and the radiance that you bring in all things and all people who God brings into your life. To watch you both live out your faith in front of all whom you know, is wonderful for Mum and I and our desire for you is to continue in your walk with God and truly following His desire for your life together. Marley has always stuck to her Christian values and morals and her beliefs. When she sets goals, she's steadfast in accomplishing them and will always see through it to the end. As parents, we would pray for our kids in that um, God would be raising up a spouse for them and uh, that would be Christian man little did we know halfway across the world and across the Atlantic God was preparing this man for our daughter Chris we are proud to call you our son and welcome you into the family Please join me in, in toasting the new couple, Marley and Chris. So it makes me the happiest man alive to be able to stand here and say, on behalf of my wife and I, thank you sincerely for sharing this special day with us. The length many of you have gone in order to be here today really means a lot to both of us. We both know it really wouldn't be the same without all of you here, so we really thank you.